Project Brissa was conducted over a seven month period, beginning in November of 2020, and led to the largest international drug takedown in our services history. 20 people are now facing a number of charges after a joint police effort that seized more than $61 million in drugs. Police say cocaine, crystal meth, and marijuana was being transported between Mexico, California, and Canada using modified tractor trailers with hidden compartments. So what you can see is, of course, this, this of course would be closed. There's another uh, covering here that would go up top here. There's a hydraulic mechanism that would open and release this area. And in behind here and above you can see there's a cavity which would allow for the storage of just about anything, or in this case, what we're alleging was uh, illicit substances. We're talking about traps. We're talking about sophisticated hydraulic traps. I can tell you they were sophisticated to the point where um, X-ray was not able to penetrate those traps. The investigation started in November 2020. In May, 35 search warrants were carried out in the GTA, some parts of southern Ontario, and in other provinces. Officers seized 1,000 kilograms of drugs, a number of vehicles, and even a firearm. As the agency responsible for border enforcement, we assisted our police partners on Project Brisa by providing them with intelligence and operational support related to trans-border activities. Investigators say that these two men are still at large. Investigators also say that collectively, 182 charges have been laid with 20 people arrested in connection with Project Brissa. In Toronto, I'm Brandon Roforce, City News.